Hello again everyone. I hope you're doing fine. In this video, I'm going to share with you my book haul from October till like November, mid-November. Okay, so I'm going to start with uh, the PDF first. This is the PDF which I shared in my previous video, The Holiday Sprites uh, Volume 1. It's from Etsy. So um, you can look, um, you know, to the flip, flip through, just a quick flip through from the other video. Okay, so I'm going to put this aside. That is for my colouring um, plans for December. And this one, the postcard, um, which I bought. Okay, and this is uh, the Peter Rabbit which I shared uh, before. So I'm not going to go into further detail about this with this book because this is the uh, completed pages uh, colouring book which I bought, um, which I did, you know. So this is the uh, pictures flip through of the postcard. This one I did. So this is just a flip through. It's very nice. It came with this uh, wonderful set of uh, pencils, which I love a lot, a lot. And it was, I, would, um, I mean, I talked about it in my completed pages uh, video. Put this aside. Next, my uh, German books. This is uh, the postcard. This is not sent by the one sent by Rita. Um, this is uh, I received just this one just just before uh, Rita's parcel came. So and I was I will be doing you know sending parcels out uh, postcards out, which I have already actually done. You know just a flick through of this, and I'm gonna send it to people and you know with like you know exchanging postcards. So this is it. Cottage Dream, which also just came not long, not too long ago, and I think you can see it in short. Yeah, uh, this is a very nice book. So I saw this book, um, I think, on Imogen's uh, channel and coloring with um, K. She has this book. So these are very nice books to have. Two more coming. Of, uh, by the same uh, illustrator those are full price books from if I'm not mistaken I think uh, Amazon or Book Depository can't remember and I bought uh, uh, this one second copy of this uh, Rita, Rita's books these are just second copies of uh, her book books Site. and of course this is <laughs> Johanna's uh, 30 days of creativity which uh, I have another one uh, which, which is not with me I think it's in the car somewhere the one with her signature this is uh, the one without her signature it came it was just a, a right hassle uh, books get uh, what do you call uh, they they cancelled my order and things like that. Oh, a lot of hassle with this book. But finally, I mean, now I've got to. Okay, so this is Johanna's uh, book, Creativity, which I think I will... I call it in the other. Or did I? Or was it this book? I think, yeah, this book. Yeah. I've got two now. So this is it. We will do... I will think... I think I will do you know bits and pieces from this book now korean books wow very expensive purchase uh, my mistake i should have checked on book depository before i you know went ahead and buy from an etsy store uh, it, the, the postage costs um the same i think or slightly more than the books the books themselves they are nice books 
I, I won't deny they have nice books okay so they're nice uh, books you know they have this uh, one side uh, they, they have this uh, sample and you just you know do your own or you just can use this as inspiration to color in this uh, hard back hard, co uh, hard cover and actually I wanted this one the, the artist uh, version but you know I, I don't read Korean and I you know I, it was I did it in the haste so I ordered this uh, forest girl coloring book and I thought it was supposed to be the hard, hard cover but anyway the paper is uh, not bad it's quite thick and I will this book you've got to sit down and slowly uh, study it and only then you color it's not like you color in a rush or in a haste no these books are these books are expensive why because of postage and so i've got like three books now three korean books okay this one i think i showed you uh, this one came just before the last haul video so i think i showed this already in the previous uh, video but it's about the same time new okay. this uh, fragile world kirby rosans oh my goodness what did i <laughs> uh this is i think his books there are lots of pictures um uh, being repeated uh, if i'm not if i if i'm not wrong there are lots of pictures or was it or is it i think this book yeah or is it in in another book which there are lots of uh, pictures being repeated oh i think i have another it's not this fragile world is this no no it's not this one i made a mistake it's uh, another bit, uh, another of Kabir Rosan's book which I can't find at the moment. So sorry. <laughs> this is, I think this one I showed you before. Okay, this uh, mythographic uh, color and discover. I saw this book in uh, Imogen's uh, videos. She showed a few times, you know, uh, her color, her coloring. Uh, which page? Yeah, and it's, it takes a long time to actually complete a page properly. So this book, I've got to sit down and slowly study the picture. Only then I can start coloring. But it's uh, kind of interesting. It's kind of, a, you know, a lot of uh, quirky things around and hidden objects around, which some I'm just going to omit it, just color over. Interesting. Okay, so mythographic, I paid full price. Okay. Now this uh, mandala coloring book. I, I showed this uh, book before in my completed pages. Um, this one page here. So, but this book is new, so it's considered in a book haul. So I did this page, and this is still a, a work in progress. Okay, so Mandalas by Camila and Jakova. Uh, I bought this book as well, 50 Winter Miniatures, also by Camila and Jakova. And I kind of like the paper, although it's, you know, many people complain about the paper, but I had no problem with it. Although I did use uh, this uh, brush pen, Okay. And I like to use mixed media in books like this. Uh, it holds, it holds the paper holds well. So, yeah. And there's another one, uh, fifty spring miniatures, I which I have not done anything. I bought, you know, them together so that it would uh, save on uh, shipping. And these two, creative heaven, heaven. Um, yeah, can you see? I think, yeah. By Teresa uh, Goodrich. So these two came together at the same time. 
Home country, uh, Chris, uh, country Christmas, which I plan to do. I showed this in the um, December plans video. And autumn since I have done. Yeah, I'm doing this, so uh, bear with me. Uh, because I photocopied the page, okay, for the color long. Right, so these are all uh, budget books, uh, which I did not pay uh, huge sums of money for them. These are actually rejected books, which are going to uh, be recycled anyway. So I bought them at a very discounted price from the discounted bookshop. I bought two of this. Uh, I might just give one away. Uh, this is the artist, artist uh, for edition. So this is a really hard bag which I can use um, all sorts of medium actually. So I have got two. One I might give away. And this one, Wuthering Heights. Um, Ro uh, Ro some Romeo and Juliet and uh, Pride and Prejudice all by the same publisher LTP publishing they were discounted heavily discounted books so I paid not much, I didn't pay much money for them and among these three books I like Wuthering Heights the best uh, if I can color every page the paper is good quality paper you know thick paper and I tried to color in a little bit uh, it's nice paper I you know just I think just overstock uh, so that's why they are just selling them for this uh, the discounted rate and it's not it's not new uh, I think the first publishing publishing was in 2017 I'm not sure if I'm not wrong not sure now okay but it's by printed by little Ti little tiger dot co dot uk so I it'd be nice if uh, you know every page is colored um, this one the background can do with uh, pastel oh, this one chalk pastels so nice so pretty see it'd be nice when the whole book is colored and I do a flip through wow let me see it's beautiful I like this book among all the three books I bought I like uh, this withering heights the best Uh, next, Romeo and Juliet, also by the same uh, publisher. And I'm not sure if they still sell this book. The paper is good. It's nice paper, white nice paper. Okay. You know they have this uh, masquerade thing going on scenes from Romeo and Juliet okay this is nice to color in I like flowers so and it'd be nice again once again if I <laughs> can complete the whole book it'd be so lovely to do a flip through okay uh, Pride and Prejudice also you know same thing you know they all look a bit similar in nature maybe what, uh, some of you might have the, already have this book because it's uh, like uh, from 2017 or 2016 these are all you know I saved the book I would say I saved them from being recycled okay I didn't pay much for them And this one, <laughs> Johanna Besford's Enchanted Forest, um, artist edition. I did not buy this when it was full price. So now they have a lot of it uh, discounted. So I grab one of it. You know, now I have the book. I have this um, um, artist edition. And I even have the... Now where's my miniature? 
I've got the miniature. See, so yeah, it's uh, the pictures are nearly the same. Okay, so I've got this at a really discounted uh, price. <coughs> now, uh, to to the next, um, you know. Excuse me. I bought um, this actually <coughs> for the team. Now, now, but these are just uh, you know rubbish pencils. Usually, um, thin things like that they come with a set of pencils. Which I tried them; they are not nice to use. So you know, I might just discard them. I bought them because they have this small tiny book which I can uh, put in my handbag. Um, even this one or just leave in the tin this is just like for relaxing coloring just put uh, color on paper and they have um, two posters as well so it's just I bought it because the tin was nice I like the tin <laughs> and yeah this book I might uh, complete it I've already done a little bit in it. This is just a, a very nice book to put in your handbag. Or you call it purse, America. Now, this one, a Pictura, is also like a, you know, I think they have discontinued this series. Uh, I have, I've actually colored the whole uh, flip this uh, book also discounted uh, it's whimsical see uh, grayscale so I've actually colored once in, in this book or uh, what uh, should I say a flip through not really a book it's just like you know a poster pull out poster so it's kind of a uh, whimsical I've got three one um, this one once upon a time See like a, uh, you know, Puss in the Boots, um, Little Mermaid, uh, you have um, Cinderella, things like that. So it's nice if you, if I can finish colouring it, uh, uh, Little Red Riding Hood, uh, Hansel and Gretel, things like that. So if uh, once finished a colour uh, colouring, you flip through, wow, well, it would be very nice. Oh, this is a uh, uh, jacket of beanstalk. <laughs> yeah, so it's nice to color sit and color slowly okay and uh, mid summer night stream also um, yeah it's nice to sit slowly this is just to take your time and color not rushing you know I won't be rushing through uh, things like that so I would just sit down slowly look at it study the picture and coloring slowly it's based on the storybook, the music, um, the musical. They have musical on this uh, Midsummer Night Stream. Okay, and this one I bought um, because I like the um, lettering. See, I might not color, you know, a lot in this, but I like the lettering. This is also heavily discounted. See this book, this uh, discounted bookshop. They save all these books and they sell it for you know at least at least uh, it's it gets sold and people you know color in them and use them and keep them and for collection and all or else they'll be going into a recycle. They're going to be recycled anyway. They're going to mash the books up and you know turn into new books. That's why it's uh, heavily discounted. So it's good that I got these books. I like the I like the lettering and you know some of the um, quotes are nice positive thoughts. Okay, the best dreams happen when you are awake. Hmm. So this is uh, I bought this because of the lettering. 
and this one this book uh, I put this to the side this one I showed in my um, December plants okay so and this one is another book which is to it comes to I mean like the same uh, by the same author Annie Davidson so this one you see the the pictures are so cute the, the rabbit the bunny and this is also the same thing the same concept one side is uh, a bit more intricate and the other side is a bit more um, it's a bit bigger for you know uh, beginners or children to color along maybe your children or your niece or nephew things like that okay you can color both uh, the same picture two person coloring in the same picture the same yeah see uh, two can color one picture so it's uh, quite nice this it's a fox sleeping. I did not actually flip, uh, look into it every every page before I bought it. I just flipped through and I said, yeah, I like this book. So here it is. I'll be colouring in them. Love them. Love this book. It's, it's cute. I don't know why. You know, I think it's just overstock or uh, not being sold. So I bought it. You know, it's good to have it at a discounted rate. Okay, <clears throat> I've got a few more to go. This one is a hardback book. It's also quite quirky. 80 designs by Sea Salt Artists. Say so. Uh, yeah so it's quite nice there are a lot of repetition but a uh, pattern but it's nice i like i like this you know and the paper is quite okay you use colored pencils prisma colored pencils will work very nicely in this or maybe a uh, gel pen or this uh, brush tip uh brush water-based brush pen or um fine liners it will work so it's nice to finish colouring in this type of books and then you flip through it's just like a coffee table uh, book you know oh this is nice okay. and uh, posh colouring book the pictures in here are cute 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 and this is also like uh, you know just to put colour onto paper you don't need to blend nothing so just as a fun coloring relaxing color coloring sort of thing this book is it's cute the pictures are cute the paper is not really that thick but i think if you just use colored pencils or water-based um, brush pen it won't bleed through i'm not sure i've not tried but i like the pictures inside it's big enough so that i can you know um, don't need a magnifying glass to see okay these are all discounted nice books you know nice books right this one is a very um quirky sort of book which i have two copies and i'm not sure if this is the another copy no this is the one I, i've not done um magical coloring by this museum it's this about this this brother and sister they went into this museum and they turn into all sorts of uh, things they turn into plants they turn into animals okay so it's quite quirky this book so some people might not like this book because the, of the background you know but i don't mind the background is done for me and i think this book is also would be very nice if once i colored in and then you just do a flip through wow it's like a coloring i mean coloring storybook see I like this book. The paper is okay. Okay, so colored pencils would work well in this. See, so he says, I want to stay an alligator. Finally, we are cats again. You know, these are brothers and sisters. 
They turn into all sorts of things. They went into the museum. Don't look into his eyes. Yeah. It's a storybook, sort of. Storybook, colouring book thing. See, and this is what happened. They turn back into human beings. And it says the end. This is a uh, sort of whimsical and quirky sort of. Uh, when was it printed? In 2017. So, I think this one, they still sell it at full price on Amazon. I think I saw it. And this uh, Botanical Wonderland, uh, I paid such little money for it. Okay. But I think they're still selling it for full price. I'm not sure. Full price would be... You see, uh, 1595 US and 1895 Canadian. It's got a lot of money. I only paid like a few dollars, two, three dollars, two dollars, I think, for this uh, book. And this book, I can go, I think I'm going to use this, uh, you know, the Brutfuna uh, color pencils, the 520 pencils. Yeah, this would be a good uh, book for me to just use all the colors, blend the colors, play with. Uh, layering and uh, colouring all sorts because you look at it it's all whimsical and the pattern it's crazy so I'm going to make use of that set of pencils and colour in this book and I'll share with you how it turns out and I've seen uh, you know this lady her name is uh, Eileen she has done a little bit on Instagram uh, it's nice it's beautiful her colouring is beautiful she did this picture which I think I'm also going to do this picture but of, of course I'm going to do it my style you know everybody colors differently so yeah so this is the I think um yeah probably I have another one or two uh stuck somewhere I will if I can't find if I can find the books I'm going to share it with you in the next haul video so that's all I have for you for this uh, book haul Hope you enjoyed watching all my books, uh, you know, nose around in the books I have. I like watching uh, book hauls, so I like nosing into what people have, uh, I, and I hope you do too. Okay, so if you like this video, just give me a cheeky thumbs up, and if you're new here, hopefully you would subscribe if you like videos like this. It would help my channel uh, a lot. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, take care and happy colouring. Bye-bye.